Facebook stock up more than 10% at this moment. Record profits up more than 60% year on year. CNN's Samuel Burke joins us now. Samuel, Facebook having a really tough year of layer upon layer of bad news, proving that they can still add users and they can still monetize them incredibly efficiently too. Talk us through it. Julia, remember all those people who told you that they were quitting Facebook? Well, maybe they did, but only for a few days, and it looks like they certainly did not delete the app. Let me just put on the screen for you the three takeaways that I really have looking at this blockbuster earnings report. It really took Wall Street by surprise. So let's start with number one. You can have a terrible year PR-wise if you're Facebook, but still have incredible sales. What I'm really thinking here is, well, where else are people going to go for digital advertising? What we hear over and over again from advertisers is that Facebook gets them to an audience, that millennial audience oftentimes, that other platforms just can't do. Number two, Facebook is shifting away from its core platform. Just like Apple's not going to report on iPhone anymore, Facebook will no longer report on how many active users they have on the core Facebook app. Instead, they'll report larger numbers about Facebook, Messenger, WhatsApp, and Instagram. Look out for more ads on Instagram. That's why the market is up. They're liking that. But one important point that we can't miss here, fake accounts up 27%, Julia. That's up to 116 million accounts now. So even though Sheryl Sandberg said after the call, we have proved that we can protect this platform, spend on security at the same time, be profitable. Well, that number really calls into question Sheryl Sandberg's statement right there. Wow. Samuel, I missed that. So, I mean, obviously in the quarter we saw costs ramp up as they're trying to police the site, but fake accounts, just repeat that number. That is astounding. Up 27% from the previous quarter. That means there are 116 million fake accounts. But some estimate that it could be even higher, that number, because a lot of times Facebook can't know that something is fake until they actually know that it's fake. It's an incredible number when you think about the fact that the elections for Donald Trump uh, and Hillary Clinton happened in 2016. We are now two years out of that election. The problem is well known and the problem is still there. That is a huge, huge glaring problem that Facebook still has. Nevertheless, the market is roaring up. Facebook up 11% in pre-market right now. Yeah, it's not a problem until the advertisers have an alternative place to go to. And mm. right now they don't. They're the only game in town.